Biden's top legislative advisor will retire. President Joe Biden's Director of Legislative Affairs Louisa Tyrrell intends to resign from her position. Politico was the first to reveal their resignation, which the White House confirmed in a statement from the president on Friday. Biden stated, Louisa has been instrumental over the past two and a half years in the historic, massive, and life changing legislation we have given to the American people. The bipartisan infrastructure measure and the Inflation Reduction Act from last year were two of Biden's top legislative initiatives that Terrell, who has been with him since the beginning of his presidency, was instrumental in getting approved. As the president gears up for re election, and the opportunities for pushing additional legislation through the House dwindles after Republicans regained control of the chamber, speculation about Terrell's departure had grown for months. She stayed in the job well into Biden's third year largely to deal with the high-stakes negotiations with Republicans over spending and the debt ceiling increase. Louise's steady hand and perseverance have consistently helped get key priorities over the finish line, said Biden, who also credited Terrell for working to secure the confirmation of Supreme Court Justice Ketanji Brown-Jackson. Terrell plans to depart at the end of July. House Democratic leader Hakeem Jeffries said his caucus members are tremendously grateful to Terrell for her partnership over the last two years. From the Infrastructure Investment and Jobs Act to the Inflation Reduction Act to averting a catastrophic default on our debt, Louisa has been there with us every step of the way, he said in a statement. She is a dedicated public servant and trusted friend of House Democrats and we wish her the best as she embarks on this next chapter. A Delaware native, Terrell first met Biden when she was five years old. She also attended kindergarten with the president's son, Bo, who died of a brain tumor in 2015. Terrell started working for Biden when he was a senator as a counsel for the Senate Judiciary Committee. She also served as his deputy chief of staff in his personal Senate office. 